Okay, well, that's Friday the 22nd of June 2018 and the SARS are still here. The weather is lining up. Everything is looking great for the next four days. So for all your weekend warriors or the guys that can only come through for the weekend or coming from inland, it's looking as if it's going to be a great weekend's fishing with the SARS. This morning, first thing, they netted at Scottborough as well as Cezela. No sign of SARS further south yet. No netting for that matter. We're not sure if there's fish with those sods. And then just to update on yesterday, the sods came in uh, Pennington first. A couple of nets were taken, but a bad sandbank sitting in the back. Again, only allowing the drone anglers to get stuck into some action. Some nice fish were caught. A really good Zambezi shark by Kwan, uh, Raw Hamilton's uh, uh, fishing partner. That was at Pennington Beach. Then they all moved up to Happy Wanderers where a couple of nets of sods were pulled and uh, some of the drone anglers again were able to get over the bank at the back and got stuck into some shark action. It seems like the drones are making a big difference with the current formation as most of the sods that were netted, the areas where they could net, happened to have a big sandbar which means the rock and surf guys couldn't get over it to get stuck into the action. The drone anglers, however, quickly dropped their baits in the back line and uh, went on rather quickly. I understand that every five minutes was a pull. So yes, as with any facet of fishing, there's pros and cons going with both. And drone fishing currently this week, with the current conditions and the formation of the beaches that they were netted, played a big important role. There are more sardines for the south that's coming up and that could change the whole ball game. Let's hope there's some game fish on some of these pockets or some of these shoals and that we'll see some great game fish catches as well this weekend. I want to ask all anglers to firstly clean up where you guys were and keep it clean. Secondly, when you're fishing for sharks or using drones, make sure you're using the right tackle guys, the right hooks, the right traces and the right gears so that we minimize the chances of sharks swimming around with traces in their mouths or meters of line behind them. Make sure you subscribe to our channel so you can receive the daily updates on the Sardine Run 2018.